What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to Pokemon Reborn. In the last episode, we deleted Lumi and Eve. And by deleted, I mean Terra deleted. But um, <laughs> that doesn't really matter right now, because we're into the next round. Friends are becoming enemies, one by one. As you can see there, you've got Hardy against Radimus, uh, Charlotte against Fira, Cal against Victoria, which I'm really interested in seeing who comes out of that one. And we're fighting Florinia, our partner in the last round. Um, we basically have to wait until we walk through the door to be able to sort out our team. So we're just going to go around, fix it up, and then I'll do a quick cut and show off the team once, uh, once I've had a little think. I know we're going to need some ice, probably. That would be very useful, because I know she has a Hippowdon and a Sand Slash from memory. And then of course there's a Ferrothorn, a Cradilly, which Ice would be really useful against. Um, who else does she have? Does she have a Roserade or something? Oh well, we'll find out the hard way. <laughs> Let's talk to everyone. I'm not sure which is better. Her being paired with me, or her having to fight me. I mean... Obviously, fighting each other isn't good, but as much as she's protesting this tournament, I think she'll be jumping at the chance to knock me out. Not just out of the running, but out of her life. Yeah, I can see where you're coming from, mate. <laughs> but the stakes have always been high, I suppose. There's no choice but to steal oneself and face them as resolutely as we can. Ah. When I think of it like that, I realize that she won't be able to win. I know what I need to do now. But first, I'll need some peace. Oh, okay. Nothing. Okay. <laughs> That's a little weird. Uh, so some people have already stepped through by the looks of it. Radamus. What was it I had said before? Let us presume to hope? I have been presuming hope for such a long time already, but hope without action is no hope at all. And now, action without heart will always be hopeless. And heart without hope has to start somewhere. God. Some of the script writing in this is so deep <laughs> for something based off of a kid's game, my god. Do you ever have a feeling like... Somehow, among everything out there in the great and vast universe, among all the stars and all the infinite possibilities, you in particular are fucked. <laughs> because I know I am. See ya, soldier. It's been fun, or something. Right, well, everyone wave goodbye. <laughs> it was nice knowing her. Now, our enemy. Which is a shame. She is a very interesting character and we have to delete her. Um, and eventually we'll be by ourselves. No more deep meaningful conversations with Radimus, Cal or Victoria going through and eventually having to delete them. And a Flowbot. God damn. Another trial remains yet necessary. The operation may prove redundant. Accepting the confounding variable or field variants. Still, a consistent outcome to prior trials may prove the most efficacious approach. Procedural standards necessitate the thorough and genuine application of effort and elements within the given scenario. The architectural features of this building appear to change based on the perception of the individuals within it. Hypothesis, the appearance of this building is itself based solely in perception. Similar to the concept of sliding doors in residential architecture that allow areas to be restructured, this place may primarily utilize augmented holograms. Further investigation is required. Is that all you have to say? Nevertheless, further time for investigation may not be granted. That's all you have to say to us after so long. Oh, we can get common candies? Well, that isn't what I want, so uh, 
No. <laughs> Give me something useful like max potions, full restores, please. Are there items in these? God, I wish I had something. Something, anything, any items? No? Of course they're not going to be easy handouts. Um, so yeah, we're basically just at a point now where we have to walk through and think about the team. So, um, unless there are any hidden items anywhere, which it doesn't look like there is, we're going to have to step through and sort the team out. This thing going to be fun. <laughs> right. So, my immediate thought, hello, no, 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 damn, right, well, the whole team, oh, uh, okay, so first things first, good thing I checked, level 95, if you're watching this, we're debugging, because uh, EV training is a bitch, and we have a lot of Pokemon. But, um, yeah, this is everyone we've Eevee trained up. And, you know, we have several boxes of stuff we haven't Eevee trained, which is a lot easier to debug, if I'm brutally honest. So, my first idea is Ice. Um, which makes me think Kipper is a no. Um, Arcanine is a yes. Oh, mate, the choices we have to make. I don't think Ampharos is any use to us at all. Um, I don't know what we have that we can Mega Evolve, which is annoying. We don't have Houndoomite. Um, we don't have Absolite. Abominus No is probably going to be very useful. I wish we had an Abominus No White. That would be incredible. Um, we could bring in some flying, we definitely need ice, fairy is kind of fine, hmm, or do I want an Alolan Ninetales, hmm, steel will be good, steel will be good, Mm -hmm. Alright, I'm gonna cut, <laughs> and then uh, I'll get back to you. Okay, we are back. It took a bit of time, but I've had to think. What we have in our box, we've got a lot of options, and it's actually quite hard to pick who we actually want. Um, Stefan, I'm leaving in, because he's just an outright menace, and Stealth Rocks could be useful, Bullet Punch to finish off, you know, he's a hard hitter. But, here is Ninetales and Snowy. I'm gonna show you what I've done. So we've got Scope Lens for the extra crit chance, Snow Warning, because we're gonna try and get rid of the uh, Hit Powdon, Sandstorm, as soon as that kicks up. So super fast, pretty bulky, EVs are in special attack and speed, Blizzard, Aurora Veil, Moonblast, Ice Beam. So we're gonna go Aurora Veil, and then we're just gonna try and power Blizzard through. Uh, exactly the same for Snowy. So we've got Earthquake for the Ferrothorn. We've got Giga Drain for the Hippowdon, if, uh, if Ninetales can't do it. Um, and then we got Ice Shard for, you know, just a quick little finish off, if possible. Uh, his EVs are in special attack and speed, as you'd expect. If we're ice sharding, we don't really need the speed, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, who else do we bring in? God. Should go without saying. It's a, f it's a grass type <laughs> leader. So, Ferrothorn, again, another failsafe just in case. We've got extreme speed, flare blitz, and flamethrower. Which should be some nice sweepy sweepies, and the charcoal is equipped. And then, right at the back, Onyx. We've got Megahorn, Close Combat, Reversal, and Brick Break. Haven't actually changed the moves at all. But EVs are attack and speed. Of course, <laughs> we're going all out. Uh, Fist Plate and Moxie. Like, he's been an unsung hero a lot, actually, during this series. And, uh, yeah, it's good to be able to use him again. But, yeah, we still got Dragonite. He's got Fire Punch. Super useful. Multiscale generally is just useful as hell. Uh, so Fire Punch, we got Out Outrage, we got Dragon Dance, and another Extreme Speed. I'm planning on trying to get a first hit just to finish stuff off, but uh, 
yeah, that is the team. So, I'm going to hit save, because I can't remember if I have not the settings. And then we're going to dive right back into it. Yeah. We can't change the time. That's sad. Right. Ladies and gentlemen, are we ready? There is no going back at this point. I'm going to hit save here, because I feel like I'm going to have to reset. Whew. Are we ready? Then let's go. Get ready for a lot of talking. I'm not even touching anything. We get to do the slow dramatic walk as we see everyone panning in. There's Hardy. Welcome, Ladybug, Gentle Muck, and non bin non binacle identifying individuals. To the next round of the Labradora Grand Tournament of that good cooch. The wheel of fate is turning. Rebel 2, Fighter. On the left. His money laundering is so out of control, people call him up for dry cleaning. <laughs> what? His history is shadier than Reborn's ghost leader. It's 7 o'clock, and he does not know where his children are. He's Rodimus Van Halen. It's close enough. Yes, yes, you're very clever. Thanks, you. And on the right. His songs may be eight tracks. But his mind is only one. It's the man with the personality of a rock and the... Wait. Shit, that was the punchline. Um, ignore that. Because it's hard on Anderson. Yo, old man. I know you got kids to look out for and all that. I feel bad for him too, but I can't back down from this one. That's just as well. Oi, hat man. Don't tell me you're going soft now, mate. We both gotta fight our best for this one. You heard it? On the contrary. For better or worse, my reasons to fight only continue to compound. Nevertheless, I have a rather strong distaste for putting others in harm's way for my own purposes. Yeah, but this ain't our fault. Blame the announcer, wench. Excuse you? I am not just some wench. I am the wettest of wenches. Okay. <laughs> and I refuse to be referred to by any other name. Make it rain, bitch. Fill that field up with that sweet wenchy water. <laughs> Okay, now stop that. I have no intentions of getting hung up on something as trivial as blame. I'm only reminding myself of my past, of a time I was not afraid of what consequences would befall others as a result of my actions. It is not a time I hold dear, but whether it is right or wrong, those who are depending on me will require me to fight for them right now. It is perhaps an a bleh. It is perhaps a necessary evil of parenthood. It ain't evil. That resilience is what makes us human. You may be right. I see that, contrary to our overseer's comments, you possess quite a bit of your own wisdom. I guess even dumb rocks sometimes have good stuff in them, eh? Indeed. We would not be in this mess otherwise, but enough of that. Let us test our humanity against each other's. Damn. Who's next? Ah, oh, I'm ready for this conversation. <laughs> Meanwhile, back at the ranch dressing. I love ranch dressing. <laughs> it's a sister showdown. A Belrose blowout battle. An all orphan encounter. She knows how to hit home. Can little Charlotte slay the dragon of her sister? Or is this dragon? about to be dragged off. This isn't going to be a match. Agreed. I forfeit. Ooh, no you didn't, girl. Did you not hear what would happen if you didn't fight? Give us a show, or else. Roar! <laughs> and just what is it to you? It's everything. <laughs> My whole life has led up to this moment. All I ever wanted was just to see you fight more, Safira. All my time, 
in circus was dedicated just to trying to be half of it as entertaining as you are, Sephira, my love. Won't you please do it for me? No. Fuck! <laughs> if she's immune to my allure as a woman, what am I supposed to do? Answer the question. I don't wanna. Rawr. Okay, new plan. You wouldn't. That's in contradiction of the rules you've already established. Do I look like I care about the rules to you? Jeez, millennials. <laughs> I'm personally offended that you would even suggest that I could ever be that kind of person. What do I look like to you? Flowbot? <laughs> cringe. Darkest, deepest, moistest, cringe. If either of you forfeit, the other one will be punished. Simple, biznitch. Hmm. No. Don't pretend like I have a better shot at it than you do. This is the most practical approach. We aren't sure if the punishment will be that different or worse, but we know what happens to the loser, so it's safer to fight. It's not complicated. This is wrong. Everything is wrong. Don't let your sedimentality jeopardize this. You're the only one I ha you're the only hope I have for moving forward. It's been that way for years. Gay. <laughs> so gay, it made the field gay too. If you win, you can go on and save me. And if you lose, you save me that way. Assuming I make it out of the next round anyway. Who else is in this again? A rock type gym leader and Killian, who I already lost to once. Gotta say, my odds aren't looking too good here. And what if you both were to be stuck here? You know what we have to do? Hmm. I wanna know, actually. That's a good point. Just don't fight. See what happens. Next up in the Raw Arena, it's Couple Therapy. The Breakup Bonanza. A divorce court combat contention. Enough. Cal and Victoria Whitaker face off for a final separation struggle. Sadly. Only one of them can walk away from this sordid love affair, QQ. Who will it be? Stop acting like we were ever a thing. Oh boy. What do you even know about any of that? I know lots of stuff. Like, the Middle name. Sees you when you're fapping. Oh god. Ring any bells? Jeez. It's like kids these days just skip all the dialogue instead of actually paying attention to the story. That doesn't answer the question. Ruffle now, you don't answer the question. Got him. Listen, Victoria, I... Nope. You wanted to do this tournament, and we'll do it. And don't get any ideas about whatever nonsense that lady is spewing. That was in the distant past. And that part of me is long gone. Whatever positive feelings I had for you were completely lost the second I found out you worked with Team Meteor. Am I clear? That's not... I was just going to say... Good, glad you got it. Hey... Self-proclaimed omniscient being. Yes? Give us a field and let's get on with it already. I'm tired of looking at this person's face. I thought you'd never ask. No, really. I didn't think anyone would ask. Appreciate you, BBG. <laughs> For your kind inclusions and benevolent initiative, I blesseth thee with thou'st holiest of field deaths. I want this over with. Let's go. Is that your patience? I'm not here to be patient. I'm here to finish this. Is that your sound judgment? There's no judgment to be made here. Stop asking questions like you have the moral high ground here. What do you know? I know I'm not about to get hung up waiting for someone who is about to sell a poffle out. Even if you did flip back. Is that what Kiki wants? Don't you dare speak her name. You're not fit to even think about Kiki anymore. Would she agree with you? Thanks to you, she's not here to do so. Which matters more, the past or the present? The present depends on the past, and you already messed up both. 
Is your anger the way forward? This isn't about me. Everything is about you. That is why you have no way forward. Is that a challenge? It's the circumstance. Only the winner moves on. And as you are right now, you are incapable of defeating me. You've lost control. We've all lost control here. I don't think I have, if I'm completely honest. Other than the fact that I have to battle my friends, which is actually, yeah, I've lost complete control. <laughs> it's out of my hands. If we hadn't, we wouldn't be fighting each other for God knows what. Contrived reason. What stupid contrived reason? Then, we should be fighting Team Meteor. Nothing in the world outside of you can take away your control of yourself. We each, for reasons of our own, forfeit that control willingly. Funny. Do you think you're clever? Do you think you're clever? Trying to use her lessons to hurt me? I will show you the way back. By force? As you seem to wish. Fine with me. And now... It's the big dog, biggest in the game. And for our third round of the match... Who again? Faces off against? Save Scum McGee! Yeah, we, yeah. I mean, I'm not mad about that. Yeah, we do hit save a lot. <laughs> this speaker laments the circumstances necessitating the upcoming trial. Nevertheless, they have been deemed necessary by the operational subject group. Accordingly, let us begin. Oh my god, stop! I have been up here trying to hype up this tournament all day, and you just come up here like, hello. I am program by Microsoft Sam. Oh my god, it actually has the thing. I had it turned down too loud because of the dubstep. I have no personality and nothing interesting to say. <laughs> I fell asleep 14 times in just those three lines alone. Rawr! Okay, new plans, guys. Pre-field dialogue is cancelled. You get a glitch field because you're a goddamn robot. Okay? Now get to it. But no boring shit. I'm watching you. Very well. Hypothesis? Hypothesis? Subject ability remains abundant enough for conclusive success. Expected outcome? Killian victory. What? You're actually backing us? Okay. Cool. I'm not asking any questions. <laughs> oh, so glitch field. From memory. Um. Hmm. Oh, and it supersedes. God damn it. Okay. Aurora Veil? Oh, we need hail. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh! Well, that might be a reset immediately. <laughs> Unless... Snowy! We got revival herbs. It'll be fine. Blizzard! Oh, Killy Dokily. Ferrothorn. Oh. Oh, okay. I see how it is. I see how it is. I see how it is. Earthquake. Oh, you are big bulk. Okay. Uh, We're going to have to bank on a crit, I think. We need to save PP. Mm. Okay. Max potion, please. Um. I might reduce as much as possible that by going for an X special defense. And then we could actually just start spamming. I might go X attack. Alright, we can withstand one more of them, so then we can just go for an Earthquake spam, I think. Uh, now we heal. Alright, so what have we got? Okay. Oh! Oh! Okay. I'm gonna go Stefan. That's a safe bet. God, we just wasted a load of X items. That's bad. I'm gonna Stealth Rock. 
Oh, you have very little to do against us. We need some Meteor Mashes to pop off bonus attack, if you don't mind. Oh, yes. Okay, that was big. That was very big. That was very big. We're hitting them all. Okay. We really need to stop using these because we've got another good few battles to go. Can I get another attack boost, please? That crit, though. It crit. That's important. Torterra. No. Stealth Rock. Oh, go again. We're faster. Oh, special defense boost. Okay. Hmm. That wasn't good. Okay, but we can go out. We can extreme speed. Or we could fire punch. I'm gonna fire punch. Whoa! Hold on a second. Okay, I'll raid. Okay. That's fine. Cradilly. Oof. Let's go. God, Stealth Rocks is doing nothing. Um. Hmm. <laughs> yep. This feels racist. <laughs> Can I get a burn, please? Can I get a burn, please? Ooh. Can I get a burn, please? God damn it. Okay. Burn! Dang. Burn! That's fine. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. So we go Dragonite. Start healing. Revival. Nine Tails. Yep. Oh, big bulky. Big bulky. Um... And... Hmm... We're better off letting them faint and just reviving them at this point, which is very funny. Um... So who has higher special attack? Alright, let's go Snowy! And... Blizzard. Ooh! Big! Very big, very big, very big, very big, very big, very big. You actually... Oh, no. Okay. Earthquake. Okay. Blizzard. Not getting lucky there. This Cradilly I knew was going to be an absolute nuisance. Oh, Raw Reveal. That was a crit? Jesus Christ, Ice Beam. <sighs> God, we're hitting crits hard. Oh, my game just froze for a sec. Um, let me go Stefan and we just start reviving a bit, maybe. Oh. Same tactic again, maybe. I hate this Pokemon with a passion. might have to actually stall you out, which pisses me off. Is that all you've got left? Okay, this is perfect. <laughs> uh, so we can heal. And then we can start X-iteming. 
<laughs> okay. Uh, and then X defend. You got it. That's fine. Uh... <laughs> Do we go for a dire hit? Nah. Let's wait. Let's wait. Let's wait. Um... Yay! We finally got something. So I'm just gonna try and not waste any useful item. Do we have any elixirs? We do. Okay, cool. Right, so that's that sorted. And now we just gotta wait. Um, we could set up hail again. The fact that an earthquake is doing this little. Okay. Um, Yggdrasil. Survive? Yes. Yes! Very good. Oh no, what am I gonna do? The present moment remains an inopportune time for emotional interference. Nevertheless. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Come on, we wasted a lot of revival hubs there, but at this point in the game, we've got enough. Very well. 13110. Challenger remains due to proceed. And that's a wrap. You do the singing, I'll take care of the hard part. Wink, 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 wink. Nevertheless, substantial option may still exist. An application has been interfaced with effectively creating a pseudo-backup repository for... Lady. Lady, stop. What did I tell you? About that thing you're doing again. Where you say a whole lot of syllables, but not very many words. All phonemes uttered by this individual veritably combine to form coherent English words. Yeah, but they still don't say shit, though. <laughs> don't talk back to me, bitch. I'll raise you better than that. Now, go take a time out. And you. You are my favorite person right now. Because not only do you never say anything, but you won. And let me shut her up. As a prize for your great service, in the name of the Terranator, you may proceed. All right. Well, that's another one down. And uh, yeah, I did realize at the end of that, Stefan, we gave X items and then switched out for Snowy. That was actually really stupid, but I guess for saving PPs, it made a bit more sense. But that was alright. We didn't even have to use Onyx. We could have done that with probably four of the Pokemon we had. Uh, that Cradilly was a nuisance, as expected. But, uh, yeah. I'm going to end this episode here, so that I have something fairly short, or shorter, than what will be another ten minutes dialogue going through this door. So, I'm gonna hit save, and I'm gonna thank you guys so much for watching. So thank you so much for watching. If you are enjoying so far, or... If you have any tips or tricks, do let me know down in the comments. And please consider subscribing and leaving a like. We're at 30 subs, and uh, yeah, it'd be great to have more people in the community. So uh, be sure to do that, and have a good one.
Take care and peace.